Hello guys, Ian here, and today I'm going to show you how to run Windows 95 in DOSBox. Now, DOSBox is an MS-DOS emulator, which can be used to emulate a bunch of old MS-DOS games and stuff, but this time we're going to use it for an IMG file of Windows 95. Oh, by the way, in the description I will also provide the IMG file and download of DOSBox, and also the code that you will need to boot up the system. Well, that said, let's get right started. Here we have DOSBox 0.74, and here we have the Windows 95 IMG file. If you already haven't downloaded these files, let's go through that part right now. AKA, okay, step one, downloading the software and the files. I will leave a link to the description of this media file link that will let you download the IMG file of Windows 95. And also, if you go to DOSBox.com and go to downloads, and press Windows or Mac OS X if you prefer to use Mac OS X. So just download it from here, wait this shortly, and yeah, just save the file and uh, install it. And same with this, just press download and save it. Then when they downloaded, paste them onto the desktop, but I'm not going to download them since I already have them both. Step 2. Making a virtual hard disk for MS-DOS. Now, the next step is what we're going to do, is we're going to go to our folders, and yeah, then we're going to go to our main SSD, go over here, and make a new folder, which we, in this situation, are going to call 95. This will not damage your system at all. Now, what are you going to do next, is you're going to take your image file, you're going to copy it, and put it in here. There we go. Well, good. Now, you're basically done with creating the drive. And that leads us to the final step, aka running DOSBox and putting in the code. Okay, so the first thing what you're gonna do is we mounted it to our C drive, which is our main drive, so put the C and then also a capital C and uh, the location of where we stored it. And now the drive C is mounted as the local directory. That means it will search around there for the IMG file. Now we're going to put it to C mode. And after that, we're going to image mount to our main drive, which is A and double points. And then it's going to be the W95.img. And now that that IMG file is mounted in the first bracket that is also called drive A of this virtual machine. And now when we write boo w95.img, it should boo right away. And now, you have to verify that your clock is all set and stuff. Yeah, that, that's about it. That's about how it is, right? And yeah, that's about it actually. Now you have a working virtual machine of Windows 95. And it also leaves a few questions to some people. Why in else would you want Windows 95? Well, me personally, I like it because it's great for experimenting, stuff and like that. I mean, I could delete any single Windows file and see how this works and stuff. And yeah, a bunch of other, other files and stuff. But we still have some games we can play. We can play Minesweeper. Well that about it wraps for this video, thank you guys for watching this video, leave a like if you enjoyed, subscribe to this channel if you already haven't to join the diamond team, comment something if you want to, and please share this video to your friend who is also into technology videos, or stuff like this. Anything but that, see you guys in the next video, bye!